Well, you're new to this rivalry, but certainly when Winnipeg and Minnesota get together, it's a full house. There's a little extra juice within the game. How much fun was this for you? So much fun. Like, uh, you know, we, we scored early. We didn't have to chase the games. And then uh, we, we kind of took the lead, scored the three goals. And then I, I kind of just relaxed back there, released my shoulders a little bit, and, and just had fun playing the game. It really looks right now like you're tracking the puck about as well as a goaltender can. Is it the repeating the game and having a chance to play three or four in a row? Yeah, I would say so. Like you, you get more and more comfortable you, the more you play. Like if if you only have one game every every other week, it's kind of like you feel like you have to perform. Like it's a must win every every game. And now it feels like I can go out do my thing and like the performance gonna be there. And uh, you see what what the teammates do, and then you know you're gonna win. I think you mentioned it earlier too. Getting that first goal for a goalie to know right away that your team has some offense in a game on the front end. Does that help you kind of lock in as well? Yeah, no, yeah, of course. Like, uh, if, if you chase the game, you know, like, every save is super extra important because if you're down 2 nothing, you know the, the energy on the bench is going to go down and you're trying to do too much to, to come back into the game. So when you score the first one, it feels like everyone's just releasing their shoulders and, and just play hockey because it's fun. It was fun to connect with you this morning, and I hope Kari Taco out there, former North Star goalie, was watching because you paid tribute to him with the green and gold tonight in that special mask, and you looked good doing it. Congrats on an awesome game. Thank you very much.